they both played outstanding. And uh, the good news is they'll continue to play like that um, along with their teammates. Tarion Crump and Kyle Glazier both showcased career highs in Brookings. Crump 10 grabs for 183 yards and a score, while Kate G recorded the fifth most tackles for Western in a single game, 21 total stops. Despite the numbers, both say the milestones mean nothing without a victory. Maybe if we would have won, I would, you know, maybe pat myself on the back a little bit. And be like, all right, you know, that was a pretty good game. But especially the way the game ended, you know, with the defense lighting up all the points in the fourth quarter, I just still really frustrated and really disappointed. I just tried to put the team in the best position to win a game and just contribute to the best of my ability. After the game, I just let the guys know immediately, just let's put this loss behind us and let's just move on and focus on Youngstown. The Valley Football Conference does not get any easier from here, and Youngstown State is no exception. Coach Hendrickson says the energy and focus is there in what he calls a tremendous bounce-back ability of his football team. And for the junior, Tarion Crump, he would like nothing more than to give his seniors, like Kyle Glazier, their first win against the Penguins. I'm trying to go in and work very hard and get them a, a victory against Youngstown. I want those guys to leave and just say they was able to beat Youngstown. And that Youngstown's a pretty talented team, and we're just working very hard each day and trying to pull off a victory. The defense gave up a season-high 33 points against the Jackrabbits, but Glazier says the D won't make any drastic changes except for a few perks for the Penguins. We got a few different packages in for them, a few different coverages that we think will work against you know some of the routes schemes that they use and the running backs that they have and everything. So I'm really looking forward to seeing how it works on Saturday. Covering the Leathernecks, Kyle Schasperger, WIU TV3.